hey guys welcome back to my channel so in this video i'll be talking about the remaining part of nimbos ig1 element one if you're watching my video first time please don't forget to subscribe my channel and without further delay let's get started so our first question is what is conventions and what is recommendations so the international labor organization or ilo so ILO usually produce standards, health and safety standards in the form of conventions and recommendations. So conventions and recommendations are the output of the ILO, International Labour Organization. For example, if India is a member of ILO, then India will be setting the health and safety uh, standards as per the conventions and recommendations. India can use this document uh, for example uh, India will be using this document as a reference right so this is called conventions and recommendations so we will be discussing uh, these conventions and uh, recommendations in the upcoming questions okay so moving on to the next question so uh, second question is obligations of employers as per convention C155 okay so the obligations of uh, employer is to ensure that workplace machinery equipment and process under their control are safe and without risk to health and second point is to ensure that the chemical physical biological substances and agents under their control are without risk to health and to provide adequate protective clothing and protective equipment to prevent risk of accident or adverse effects on health okay uh, so these are all the basic uh, obligations of employer as per convention 155 <coughs> so our next question is obligations of employer as per recommendation 164 okay obligations of employer uh, as per recommendation 164 is provide workplaces and work equipment and use work methods which are safe and pose no risk to health okay so provide appropriate instructions and training provide necessary supervision put in place health and safety arrangements adopted to suit the size and nature of the undertaking provide any necessary personal protective clothing and equipment free of charge so as per this uh, standard every companies are providing us free ppes okay and the next point is ensure that the hours of work do not adversely affect employees health and safe, health and safety and take measures to eliminate any extreme physical and mental fatigue and stay up to date with knowledge in order to comply with the above so our next question is general responsibilities of workers as per recommendation 164 so the basic workers responsibilities are take reasonable care of their own safety and that of other people who might be affected by the things that they do and the things that they fail to do and comply with the safety instructions and procedures use all safety equipment properly and not tamper with it report any situation which they believe could be a hazard and which they cannot themselves correct and report any work related accident or ill health okay so these are all the basic responsibilities of workers so our next question is the basic rights of workers as per convention 155 okay the right to be provided with adequate information on actions the employer has taken to ensure occupational safety and health so workers have the right to know the actions that an employer is taking okay so the second uh, thing is the right to the necessary training in occupational safety and health so the workers have the right to receive the necessary trainings in occupational safety and health okay so the third thing is the right to be consulted by the employer on all matters of occupational safety and health relating to their work so this is the main thing so the workers have the right to uh, say anything to their employers about their work related uh, activities or uh, something related to their uh, uh, health and safety right so the last thing is 
the right to leave a workplace which the worker has to th uh, has a reason to think presents an imminent and serious danger to their life or health and not be compelled to return until it's safe so if you found this video useful please don't forget to give a thumbs up and if you have any doubts if you have any queries please tell me that in comment section so if you want a negosh igc new syllabus textbook uh, soft copy please comment your email address in the comment section if you are watching my video first time please don't forget to subscribe my channel and thank you so much for watching this video